The third example, find measure of angle 1 and measure of angle 2. So very similar, we have um, interior angles, both, both of these are interior angles. This is 80, this is 130. So um, I, I can just use those to find um, this angle right there. So 130 plus 80 divided by 2 is going to be 210 divided by 2. And then that's going to be 105. So right here, 105 degrees. That's not our answer though because we're looking for a measure of angle 1. So here, since this is a linear pair, I'm going to take 180, so measure of angle 1 equals 180 minus 105. And that's going to give us 75 degrees. Measure of angle 2 is vertical to angle 1, so uh, measure of angle 2 is going to have the same angle measure. Okay. And then the for this one here, um, we can just use these intercepted arcs to find measure of angle one. Sixty degrees again interior angle, so we're going to add up the numbers plus forty two divided by two. So that's going to be a hundred and two divided by two, which is fifty one. So this is fifty one degrees. And then to find measure of angle 2, it's supplementary. So 180 minus 51. And that's going to be 129 degrees.